Hey you guys. <laughs> I know this is Miss D at D Special Things. The last thing I had to do today, and I gotta do it today, is finish my tags. Oh my gosh, you guys, I still have to, and I'm gonna pan you down here. I know I'm all over the place. Hi, new subscribers and anyone else that you know my old subscribers <laughs> anyone that's just dropping by subscribe if you are not um like if you like <laughs> i don't know if you'll like this video but it is early morning here and it's going to rain all day long so i decided <sighs> you know what i'm gonna do a video because i want to finish these and i know if i do a video it would make me finish these right well, let me show you what I use to do these. And right now, I'm, I'm getting ready. I've already lost two of these. So, what I'm going to do, so that I won't lose anymore, because these stickers have lost their stickiness. I've favored these stickers for quite some time. I, I know I got them from Amazon. Um, yeah, so... I am actually going to, I have to hear these or I'll lose them, guys. And what I'm doing is I'm going to just kind of pretend I know where these letters are going to land. <laughs> I know, right? I just wrote them on. And I'm going to adhere that glue on there. The glue will dry clear. So, I'm not, or you could just, you could have just put some glue down there and let it. Sometimes if I use, um, what's the name of it? If I use uh, my tweezers, <laughs> they'll stick to this. But I do have some silicone things. Let me see, where are those little ones? I had bunches of them. Um, those with rubber. I got some over here. These are something of Timu special. These. So we'll see now. I haven't used these, but we'll see if by chance they work. And they are individually wrapped. So now I gotta deal with that. <laughs> okay, this is a long one. And this is for my resin, but I'm gonna use it on here to see if it would adhere this down to here. Help me move this too. Mm hmm. Yeah, so. Let's see. This works like I want it to. Kinda, sorta. <laughs> Can you guys see me? Yeah. Yeah, so that means I'm gonna have to go ahead and do these because before I do anything to them, this has to dry. But anyway, I'm going to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you what my ornament is going to look like this year <laughs> i know you see it already right but <laughs> maybe you could use tweezers that might be better um yeah but sometimes my fingers the glue will get on my fingers except for this glue i use this glue for everything just about not everything <laughs> yeah you know you'll know what kind of glue to use depending on what it is you are making okay um you guys <laughs> i am actually using to make this decoration i'm using this ornament from make market and it's from michael's and during black friday they had a sale i think these were 60 percent off and then you got to use an additional 25 percent. i don't know something like that but anyway they they're still on sale and they were still on sale i only had eight that i got off the store i think one two three four five six one two four six seven i don't know maybe there is an eighth one somewhere and it's yeah but anyway I wanted to use this, well, I used this, and I actually took the ribbon, where's my ribbon, um, right here, I bought this from Michael's also, I think, or it could have came from Big Lots or one of those stores, but it looks to be about an inch and a half, let me measure, 
it is, yeah, an inch and a half. And um, I just turned it on this side and I traced, I evened it, you know, lined it up here and I just traced it and cut it out and I put these on here. And the numbers come from, I think I told you that, Amazon. And they're in an eight pack. And these are just the numbers that I like. I should be printing this stuff myself, but I'll see how that goes once I decide if I'm going to get that Crooked Maker 3. I am so not leaning towards that. Uh, but my niece, I promised her if she got it, I shouldn't have promised her that, that I would get it and we could learn together. We're going to learn why she was here. She's here through the New Year's holidays. Ah. Uh, I don't know that I even want that machine. I have every machine. I have not had a crooked, actual crooked cutter machine um, in some years. Yeah, so, I mean, I have the scan and cut. I have the, I don't even know what machines I have now because I have not used them over the years. But anyway, back to my ornaments. They're going to end up looking like this. But the back will have a back on it. And then it's something I'm going to add to it. And I'll I'll show you how this is going to be my ornament and my... <laughs> I think the dog is barking. He probably hear me. I don't think he could hear me. Oh, and every time I think he's, he could hear me, I normally always see somebody walking their dog or running or exercising or something. So he's probably not even paying me <laughs> any attention. And I doubt that. You know how dogs, he's a hound. So I'm sure he can hear uh, far away. Let me see if I see anybody out here. Nope. But sometimes, because yesterday I saw him barking at a cat. <laughs> And the cat was not paying him any attention, but he was letting him know that he saw him. But anyway, you guys, when I finish, I'm going to show you how I use these on my packages. And uh, yeah, but these, I got the, the these things from Walmart. Yeah, and it has these little... Um, tie things on it. So I'm going to use those to adhere them to the actual uh, acrylic ornament. Yeah. And if you don't have these, you can use wood pieces, the round wood disc. You can use the acrylic wood disc. I promise you they sell these in Michaels just like this. And I think a pack of 50. I know I have some. And you could easily just take whatever kind of ribbon you want. If you want it decorative or whatever, put it over the top and the bottom. And I only did the back because I wanted it to look finished. Um, yeah, so by the time I finish, I'll decide if I'm going to do the back. I may not. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'll see but I do want it to look finished. But anyway, you guys, that's what I'm working on today. And then once I finish with this project, I am going to do some more cleanup organizing in here in my craft room because this will probably forever be one of the places that I record my videos or just sit and chat with you guys. I am having to work on my some of my camera equipment and my camera applications and i think today will probably be a day for me to sit down and go through some stuff and take some notes and catch up yeah so um yeah i'm i should be able to come back to you guys and um yeah do another video of stuff that i'm doing i don't know if you could see this on the floor down here this is the village that I'm actually making myself. Well, everything except for those. I'm cutting some uh, ATC cards too. I like doing the thick ones. So that's of some cardboard that I'm using. Don't look at my rug because that will come up one day. I don't know if it's next, but yeah, it'll come up. So I'm, I want, I wanted to do this for, for Christmas. I wanted to have a Christmas village, but I got caught up in a whole bunch of other things. Uh, one thing that is great, hopefully by 
next week i'll find out who's going to pour my concrete foundation and then hopefully i'm hoping 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 by the first of the year i could get my house put on my foundation and then have my electrical and plumbing run in january i plan to be in my house in my little house over there with it organized and everything up by march and that includes me getting everything where I want it, my walls up, my insulation done, my flooring done, decorated. I can't wait. Yeah, so that's what I'm working at. It's just like I take two steps forward. I got to take a step back. So yeah, that's just the process. So that's what I'm working with right now, but I'm going to get her done. All right, you guys, but I'll probably come to you all later because I don't want this to be a long video. You guys, who... <laughs> would sit and listen to a video. I used to say that all the time, but you know, I listen to quite a few of you guys. Oh, thank you all for all your well wishes for your happy holidays. If I don't get back, because right now I am at home through the holidays because uh, my son, his wife and his family got sick. Uh, they have COVID and colds and this and that and a lot of different stuff. So I decided it was no it was not the time to go see a brand new baby. So we decided we're going to wait until January, probably during the holiday, the first holiday, other than the New Year's, they come apart, you know, they come up. Um, because I just, and I know I mentioned to you guys, I just had a <laughs> great grandbaby. Yes. Um, a little girl. And you guys... Y'all can't tell me I ain't blessed. <laughs> I am having another granddaughter, a little girl, oh my gosh, in May. Yes, so I'm happy about that. But I am so happy. I'm happy. I'm blessed. Oh my gosh, yes. But anyway, enough of me. And this time, I'm really hanging up. And I'll see y'all on the next video because I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you all the... Um, these ornaments that I'm working on because I got to get them finished. All right, you guys, and we'll chat later. All right, you all have a blessed day and happy holidays, you guys, even if I if I don't get back, but even if I do, and I, I know I will, uh, happy holidays to everyone and enjoy and be safe. All right, love you guys. Bye-bye.